Queen Gija and in today's video I will be reacting during to the finale of Magic of Aguare. So let's go ahead and get started in three, two, one, go. Please do not leave me on a cliffhanger. I swear to god, this is the last episode. Everything has to tie up in a nice neat freaking bow. Please don't. I beg you. Go wake your girlfriend up with a kiss. Well, not the kiss that I really wanted, but that's okay. Mm -hmm. I gotta be around there somewhere. No. No. I'm not accepting that. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, she just, I mean, I just had a little mini like. <laughs> but I get the reason of why she wants to do it because she. She doesn't want it to be like before, but it already has. You've established a connection with them, and you don't want them to get hurt or die or turn into witches. But you know, that ain't gonna happen. It's a doppel now. But I get it. So then where the heck is the Aroha going to live now? Let's think about that. Where is any of these girls going to live out now? Oh my god. Yeah, sure. What the fuck? Because she's got too attached to you guys and she doesn't believe you. That's not a reason! That's bullshit. She said it, not me. Not if she protects herself and others.
She ain't dead, is she? I mean, come on now. Is Curl finally going to make an appearance again in this show? Come on. <laughs> oh, she might have to become best girl. I mean, I've loved this girl since episode one. Because the first time when I met her in the game, I had mixed feelings. I was like, I don't know if I'm going to like her. And oh, She's so precious. I'm happy we get to see her one last time, though.
The girl with the purple hair. No, I think I have her. The hell? There's a fire extinguisher. <gasps> no! Is mommy about to use her doppel on the lid? I'm a little scared right now. Oh, holy mommy! I need this card so bad. But I gotta wait till Christmas again. Who knows if I'll even come back. If this show ends and Madoka doesn't make a fucking appearance, oh my god. <laughs> my Mimi is so pretty! Oh. No! You say that.
I'm afraid you thought. Well, if there's one thing that I can kind of compare the doppel to, it's the stuff that happens in Yuki Yuna as a hero, that final form, like, they can never use. Mankai, that's the name of it. I don't know how the heck that came to me. She's so pretty, even though she evil. Not like this. Oh, okay, not my shit. Oh. 
God. No! Oh, you may. Don't end in like a Do not end this on a cliffhanger. Was that Curl? Curl finally made another appearance in this show? Even Felicia. Okay, so I got I got a couple questions. Chapter wise in the game, what chapter is this? <laughs> because oh god, this just felt like Oh yeah, that's just telling you season two coming. You just don't know when, but season two coming. This has got to be the way that this just ended. This is arc one. This is end of chapter one or arc one in a nutshell. The fact that Yui and Felicia are both a part of this. It, Futaba, you a part of this too? I mean, seriously, like... The fact is that all of these girls have disappeared and they all were in their all complete different sections and I kind of hope that with season two we get to see their POVs of what they saw at the same time what Iroha saw because we got to see that for her. But for everybody else who was in that group and who all went to this museum all at the exact same time and all got separated, it would be nice for them to do that in season two. And it makes you kind of now want to look... Like, let's say... Two to four weeks from now, I decided to sit and I rewatch all 13 episodes. And especially looking at Yui, Felicia, and whoever else, Kaede, Momo. Not predominantly Reina, because I still love her to death. <laughs> I still love these girls. But it's going to make you look at some of these characters a little bit differently than the first time. And you're going to catch things on the first time. I mean, the second time that you didn't relatively catch the first time. Because seeing this end like this... It leaves you with a lot of more questions than answers. I mean, oh god, because I feel like, because I don't know, I, I can't say what chapter this could be on, but I'm between four and five, and I haven't played since last week. And I was like, I don't want to play until I, I continue playing again until I finish the show and try to catch up to wherever this is, because this is somewhat maybe later on. And the fact is that, it, it, like, okay, here's another thing I need to know. That they need to go on into season two. We know Kuro is an anime-only character. I've been saying that for weeks now. And to finally see this girl again in the last freaking episode, it still makes you want to know, 
what in the heck was she doing for episodes two to last week? She has to be her own, doing her own investigation for some weird reason. And I hope that there can be an episode, it could be a filler, a one filler episode that they can do in season two to just put it into the story. And I know a lot of people will probably, who are currently playing the game and who are going to possibly start playing this game officially as of today, because they maybe wanted to wait until the anime was done to play it or possibly play it when this first, when the episode first aired and such. I don't really know. But because of the fact is they need to really do something on her because I feel like she was a very not useful enough of a character because of the fact is you only get to see throughout these <laughs> this entire first season you only see her twice she to me she felt like a letdown because i was thinking okay they're gonna have her be in every single freaking episode be that much important to iroha even though she is an anime only character and she has nothing to do with the plot of the game but in, in a way she does so she's gonna be somewhat canon in a way but and i was thinking okay throughout these 13 episodes we're gonna figure out how she necessarily was gonna be canon but because of the fact that she's only been in two episodes you're sitting here wondering at the end of this final episode and looking at this show overall why was she here what was her purpose throughout this first season just to be like she feels and I can't believe I'm about to say this. She feels dead weight to me. Like, she was a character that had so much potential. And then it's just like, I don't know, maybe the the people at Shaft was just like, last minute, let's kind of not really do that much for her. And if the show gets a season two, we'll give her as much as we can for her. But it's like, they could have did so much better with it. So that's my only little thing that I'm a little pissed off about. That's it. I mean, that's a little thing that they can change in season two, but everything. This freaking fight with Holy Mommy, like, that was God tier. That was God sent. That was beautiful. I mean, the, look, this is the same people who fucking did the Monogatari series, and I'm just looking like, it, it, this is really the same company, right? The same studio who animated that show, and going back and forth between this show and that show, and seeing the differences, but, like, the similarities, especially with, like, head tilts, or, like, the way they do something, and especially, I think, because they also did the movie, the Monogatari movies, I'm not 100% sure, I gotta go look, but, like, oh my god. But now the biggest thing is wondering, what the hell is gonna happen next? Where is this arc at for chapter wise because i think when i go ahead and edit everything i'm just gonna try to hurry up and catch up as much as i can so i could probably maybe get up to chapter eight which i think we are in ian maybe in a day or so it just depends um but the biggest thing like seeing holy mommy <laughs> mommy again in general and then oh my god but I really wanted Madoka to be in this last episode because this was the last episode, but it's okay. You know what? I'm not really mad about that. And that just gives you like the little possibility of hope that she could be like finally make an appearance in season two because now officially every girl except Madoka and Homare are the only two who have not made an appearance. So, and honestly, like when mommy was shooting her bullets and like, it stopped for a moment. I was like, oh my god, it's like, oh my god, I finally here too. And it just, no. Yeah, you got me a little hype for like almost a moment. It's like how in season one of Love Life Sunshine, where they were freaking out, like, oh, we're possibly gonna go see Nosa Bean, and I freaked out. And then they ain't show my best girl. So, <laughs> but honestly, this was good. Really, really good. And I just hope that with season two, they do a little more on Kuro. I hope that Aroha gets to finally find Yui. I don't want it to be um, essentially dragged on as like, let's go four or five seasons worth and she still has not found her sister. I, I would say if I could give a little prediction of where I want, when I want Yui to be found, somewhat between season two and season three. And then maybe, like, doing an episode on Yui's POV. Because I still want to know what Yui has been up to during this. Especially with the fact that her friend is, you know, a bad guy. And I kind of hope that it's, like... And let me ask this real quick. Is her card in the game? I mean, because... Or if it's not in the game now, is it gonna be in the game, like, sooner? Because we know... I think Japan is, like... Their server is two years ahead of us. So, I mean... 
we still relatively at the beginning. I'm still wondering if Holy Mommy and Holy Alina are going to come back. So it's a lot of unanswered questions with this show and with the game. So, but yeah, I really enjoyed this for what it was. And can't wait to see what the heck is going to happen in season two. I'll probably end up knowing by maybe by tonight, depending on where chapter eight ends. But other than that, guys, that is my reaction to the series, Magic of Recorded. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Master Squad. And, of course, I will see you guys officially all next week for the start of spring anime. But until then, I will see you guys all next time. Bye!